Well, Bemidji's newest playground has been a big hit for many families, but for some kids, it means much more than being just an attraction. Our Brenda Mack tells us more on this week's Community Spotlight. <laughs> Swings and slides. Now, which kid could resist that? But for some kids, to play in a park is their one simple wish. It is hard. It's really hard to find a park where she can move through. Emma has a mental syndrome, which affects her growth and limits her mobility. But here, she is just a kid. Here she can play on anything she wants. Oh, very excited. She likes to sigh. Excited, excited, excited when we come here. In fact, we pulled in and she was squealing when we got in the parking lot, ready to get out and go. But Midri's only all-inclusive playground has been two years in the making. But those two years now bring new meaning to each person who stepped foot at Paul Bunyan Park. You walk or roll, whether you talk with words or sign. At the end of the day, they see that they're just kids who want to play. And more importantly, they're kids who want to be included. Now with an all-inclusive playground, that means kids my age can play too. Yeah. <laughs> Don't think of this just as a playground for little ones, but it's for everybody, adults. It shows their friends that a wheelchair is only a helping hand. At this park, swings have safety harnesses and there are ramps to elevated play areas. But look, there's some trails for her to walk around found in this park and uh, I'm really happy for her. No matter her condition, Emma sees life and its beauty and now others can do the same too. Uh -huh. yeah. You like it here. Favorite. <laughs> for this week's Community Spotlight, Brenna Mack, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.